going on? Driver holler at me on the radio when I passed him on 82. Said I had a light hanging down. And I know I know it wasn't hanging down this morning. Three lights up on top, and ain't no, no, them hanging down. There's little trucks out here invading, it's kind of a, kind of a little rat hole, but used to, it was a long time ago where all the drivers stopped at. That used to be a bar up there. All the drivers used to stop up here and be parked all around this circle. He was on the pasture side in the right lane. How in the hell do you see that light hanging down from up underneath there? And he's in a truck. And, and this truck has got them things on it, them ragged ass things that California thinks is saving fuel. Got one on both sides, right? Huh? Anyway, oh, yeah. it's fixed now. Yeah, I, got, uh, I know that light wasn't hanging down this morning. It must have jarred loose coming across 82 and 65 out of Arkansas and all that. Because I come down from, uh, come across 40 and come down at Little Rock. Got on 5, I think it's 5.30 at Little Rock. And uh, come down to 65 and come down to Greenwood, Mississippi, hit 82 there. Or, or 65 actually runs into 82. But uh, it turns into 82 at uh, the Mississippi line up there across the river. guy there is out of Carthage. Them boys, I don't know, they, they, <clears throat> they think they saw me up, but uh, they're the type of drivers that they just work for the 
this company and their truck to go a million miles an hour and all that bullshit. But, uh, I don't know. I've been working for this company here for uh, a month or two, and so far, you're going you to have to be doing something to be a better company to work for than this one. This one. I mean, these people here, if something's messed up on your truck, they fix it. If you got to go in the shop for something, they put you in the shop and have your problem fixed, and then you back out on the roof. better company than the company I was working for <laughs> when I started making these videos and you call that dude with a problem you better not put it in the shop you better run that server until it breaks down and then it's gonna be your fault it breaks down and shit I had the, the reefer unit go out on me one time up in uh, Sacramento California got a red light on the unit, not, not on this trailer here, not with this company, but the other company. My wife was with me. And uh, got looking in the mirror, going up 99 out there, heading to, Baker, uh, heading to Sacramento. And uh, I pulled over on the side of the road and went back here and checked the code and it was a damn alternator light. An alternator code, the alternator done went out. And instead of getting it fixed, call my boss man and instead of him telling me to get it fixed he told me to run a jumper wire a jumper wire from the battery on the reefer unit to the battery on the truck and he told me after I got emptied out the next morning in Sacramento that we'd get it fixed well I got emptied out and I called him and uh he said well he just uh is it running good I said yeah it's running good I said it's hooked up to my truck battery you know, got a jumper wire on it, and he said, well, just uh, bring it on back home, and we'll get it fixed down here. <laughs> so I had to run all the way from California all the way back to, the, to Florida, and then back to the house with jump wire on the damn battery to keep, it, keep the unit running. <laughs> Man. But yeah, I don't know how the guy saw that light hanging down from anything. Stop there. 
something to eat, get the fuel, go up there, they lay it over, go up there to the damn bar. Crap like that, I, I ain't never been to bar type. I ain't never cared much about bars too much. Too much shit going on. Something leave out Monday or Sunday night or Monday. 